Alright guys, so last time we went over the presets and all that, and the time before that we went over the piano roll, so now this time we're going to go over the beat bass line, so let me open this, oh it's already open, my bad, it's this thing right here, beat and bass line editor. So essentially what you can do here is you can go to like kicker where there's drums at and you can add drums shaker snare snare let's get a clap and a hi hat and then in order to make this longer this would be like one bar right here two three so you can make it longer. You can go full screen if you want to, make it easier for you. Right here. This is usually like the amount I use. It's four measures. Um let me see. Just to start out simple. That sounds bad. Hold up. Oh yeah, to get rid of them, you just click. You mess around. This isn't going to sound good because I'm just trying to show you all an example, but I'll just fill it up, you know. But yeah, you want to clear the whole thing, go here, move this track. And so once you have the beats you want to use, the drums, you go here. And you go where your beat baseline is. You make sure it matches up because you can have multiple of these. Because you can have beat baseline one, or if you want to make a new one, you go to uh, right here. Click that, it makes a new one. So then you can alternate between these two. So yeah, that is just a real quick tutorial on how to do a beat and baseline editor. Next video, we're going to bring all three of them together. Alright. I will see y'all.